in this one I'm going to talk about renaming files um, like if you have a lot of files and you want to rename um, in a large scale you know like a hundred files or even as little as like three or four files you can do it too but it's really designed for like a massive scale um, so we're going to be doing a, a batch file renaming and uh, for this example I'm going to do um, um, my mp3s that I got see I have um, the, the titles on here but I do not have the artist so we're gonna insert the artist into all these files it's the same artist so we're gonna use uh, GP rename um, if you want this also it's in the add and remove just type in the name and search for it um, and then you, what you want to do is um, you see all these in the side these are your navigation like you know what folder you want so in this case I'm going to do Chinese Paladin's uh, soundtrack so I got the soundtrack here and and these are the songs as you can see um, it's mp3s and it does not have any um, artists associated to it so what I'm going to do is have to insert it in uh, first I want to um, select all the ones that since all of these are the same artists I'm just going to select all and then I'm going to insert right here and I already type in uh, the artist and I just also want the, um, this um, dash here and the space here so you can see in the preview that it will come out like this see preview and then you'll see um, on the side here they generate a preview of the names so I'm going to scroll over and let's see, expand this a little bit more. So these these are the preview names that I want. See now it's gonna add Chinese Paladin, um, sp space, and then the dash and the space, and then it'll just um, use the same uh, tracks that it will use in uh, my current one. See these are the tracks. They don't have any artists in front of it but I insert it in here so now I know that I wanted that all I gotta do is click rename here and done it's done right let me check if it's done correctly and as you can see they all replaced it with Chinese Paladin in the beginning so it works so if you need something like this to rename your uh, stuff or add something to your files, this is a great way to do it. They also have uh, other options like uh, you can delete stuff in here too. See, so let's insert and delete. Or you want to replace something, you can do that too. Um, it has uh, numbers, like if you need to number your your photos or, or your music or whatever, you can do that. It has a few other options, but... I'm not going to get into it. I'll let you guys experiment with that. So, that's all on this program.